Hey guys, welcome to my channel and we're going to do Hey guys, welcome to my channel and what we're going to do is some lobster Cajun rice So as you can see right now, I have My fresh bell pepper that came out of my garden Yes, I have bell pepper Onions, garlic We're going to to the pots right here and let them brown. Yes, this is a little seafood. So how have everybody been doing? Have everybody been praying and enjoying this COVID-19 boy? That's been so crazy. So you want to let them Mmm, get that aroma going in there and translucent and get a little browned. After that, you want to make sure you get your long grain rice because you're going to add it in here and let that fry a little bit. And yes, you know that. Papa. You know them good things get the smelling good. So I'm going to add in some diced onions on top of them onions. And how about going to get some roasted garlic. This is for all uh, these vegetarian I have that want to eat healthy. I have my lobster already just boiling and just putting some water in the plant. But we got these going. Boom, boom, boom. How you like it? Yeah, so um extra virgin olive oil and put that in there. Basil. Basil, baby. Boom. Basil. Does it feel like four squares of basil? You can't live without your oregano. Mm, oregano. Oregano. Yes, I put a lot of it in there. Then you're going to get a bowl of water and add some chicken to your seasoning. Now you just want to leave it off and then get it to sit. Okay. So, that is how it's going to be looking. While you still have that still going. And Getting soft and getting all the flavor together with the basil and the oregano. Eh, uh, oregano. Yeah, oregano. Oregano only. Okay. So now you know what time it is. A chicken we are. Hot water going. Hot water going. Hot water going. We're going to steam. Lobster tails. We're gonna stain the lobster tails in a pot. And let's 
pressure cooker. Now we want to add in, we want to add in your long burn rice. Now you want to add in a cup of And you want to put enough that you like. Because I'm going to tell you, this rice is so good. It's so seasoned, perfect. Perfect. So where well, you'll want to eat this in the morning. Trust me. So we're just going to let that just put in. And so now, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't know, you know how smelling that is. You want to grab your Kanye pepper and you want to put it in there to your liking. Um, I'm picky on what kind of salt I intake. A little paprika. So I do sea salt on pink Himalaya salt. That's the only thing I do, we're gonna do a little Kanye pepper. Okay, so there are the lobster inside the pressure cooker. You have some lobster crab oil, you have butter, you have garlic. You have sea salt and pepper, and you're just going to put it in the pressure cooker. Boom, um, snap that. Turn on. Boom, see that light? See that light. And then you go to piston. That will be number four. And this start. So you let that go, and while you let me go, you continue with your rice. So you have your rice, you see it's cooking. It's looking delicious, guys, I promise you. It is smelling delicious. If you want to, you can add my baby, but really, you just want to get this rice brown, a brown color that it's cooking. I can find it right now. And um, it's just locking out the flavors, you know? you want to taste if you want to taste all them herbs you want to taste some bell peppers it is going to be a little spicy if you don't want it too spicy don't put too much kanya kanya and pepper inside i'm sorry but you can see i'm just going to give y'all a good view this camera is all over here there's my battery I'm going to turn my stove light in. And it is warm enough for that. A little bit. Okay. And I got it going on, guys. It is smelling so good. My son is on that game, but when he gets through, he would have the best vegan meal there is. Yeah, do you hear that popping and sizzling? Oh, I heard them. Lobster, the pressure cooker is starting to push up. So, remember, basil. I will leave the directions to this ingredient inside the bottom of the directions. Last, I don't think a lot of people heard of this. It's called tarragon. And we will add a little tarragon in there, not too much. It is a strong vegetable season. And. This right here is chicken beans season that I'm just putting in here. And after that, I will go over and store the saltine and grilling some shrimp, shrimp kebabs on the grill. And it's it's on fire, baby. So you want to pour all that water in there.
and this is part of our and my favorite sea salt a little to it because I'm eating seafood anyway. I don't want to put too much in there. Add a little, another half a cup of water. Let this come to a boil. And we will put the top on there. And let it smudge and smudge. And when the rice get fluffy, I will show you at the end of this video. Lobster Cajun rice. My favorite. So guys, we are just waiting. I'm going to turn on my stove, stove top, top grill over here for some kebabs and uh, get them going. Okay, the lobsters are ready. Thank you for watching my videos. I have a blessed day, blessed weekend. Ahaya is always in charge. Thank you.